like Mark Senior's wellness disclaimer. This exercise video is presented by Active Health Services for Life Mark Senior's wellness. Please note, you should always consult with your physician prior to following this video or any exercise program. This video does not replace nor should you interpret it as medical advice. Do not proceed with any exercises that are beyond your fitness or ability level. And for safety reasons, we highly recommend you have someone in your presence while you participate in our online videos. If you experience any pain or discomfort at any point during these videos, please immediately stop and never ignore or delay seeking medical attention if pain or discomfort persists. And as with any exercise program, there are risks in participating. Participation in the Lifemark Seniors Wellness class is done so at one's own risk. Understanding no medical supervision or assessment is provided to determine suitability for the program. Lifemark Seniors Wellness is not responsible for or liable for any harm loss, medical problems, or other consequences you may suffer resulting from the use of this video or the reliance on the information provided to you in this video. And by choosing to proceed with this exercise video, you are acknowledging you understand the terms on which we're providing the video and you agree to those terms. And if for any reason you're not comfortable with these terms or you do not fully understand them, kindly ask that you do not proceed with the exercises at this time. Alrighty, we're gonna start seated today. You want to have some water handy uh, and your weights. If you're using weights, bands if you're using bands. I think we're sticking with weights for a little while here. So just on your chair, feet flat on the floor, heart lifted, All right? Relax your shoulders and your jaw. You take three breaths from your belly or diaphragm. So inhale through your nose. Exhale either through your mouth or nose. Nice and easy. Now the deep breath in. Exhale. One more deep breath here. Excellent. Exhale. And start easy. Turn your head to your right. Keep your heart lifted and your back flat. And just glance in behind with your eyes. Bring your eyes back in line with your head. And then your head back to center. Take your time with all these movements. There's no rush at all, all right? Over to the left side, your left. And just glance in behind with your eyes. Bring your eyes back in line with your head. Bring your head back to center. Fantastic. And just lift your chin up first. Look up. Gentle stretch on your neck. Excellent. Bring your eyes back in line with your head. And then your head back to center. Fantastic. And last but not least, chin to chest. Look down towards your chin. Stay with your breathing from your belly. And on an inhale, bring your head back to center. Fantastic. Shoulder shrugs. Uh, let's do both at the same time this today. So lift them up and exhale down. I'm gonna get you to use your breath with this too. So inhale up and exhale down. Bring your shoulders down to a rest. Inhale up. Exhale down. Fantastic. Up again. Exhale down. One more time. Excellent. Fantastic. Get your shoulders reset there. I'm gonna go for some shoulder rolls. Small to medium size, you can let your hands hang if you like, or leave them on your lap. Again, I'm gonna get you to use your breath as you do these exercises. So you're gonna, as you inhale, bring your shoulders up. As you exhale, bring them down. Inhale up, 
wheel down. Not too fast, nice and easy. Fantastic. And we'll get you to change direction. The other way around. Inhale up. Exhale down. Just find what feels good. If the small to medium sized circles aren't serving you today, you can go for a little bit bigger or not at all. Fantastic. And yeah, bring your shoulders down to a rest. Fantastic. Rotate your wrists off to the side here. You're going to bring your wrists up front. Excellent. Change direction. Nice. Bring your arms out to the side. Just going to move over a little bit here. Perfect. Fingertips up. Excellent. Fantastic. Just nice, easy. Push high, push low. Keep your heart lifted and your back flat. Breathe. Excellent. Back to center. Let's take a breath here. From your side. Push high, push low. Fantastic. Come back to center again. Just straighten your fingertips out. And just wiggle them there. Nice. Make a fist and flick. Fist, flick. Excellent. Just a few more here. Get the joints in your fingers all lubed up. Perfect. Three more, two, and one. You slow your arms down, nice and easy. Fantastic. Let your shoulders reset here. Nice. We'll move down a little bit further here. Let your shoulders kind of reset. Pick a leg. You're just going to heel toe. Nice. Again, keep your heart lifted and your back flat. Opposite arm, you can do a bicep curl. So let your hand hang low, bring it up, flex your bicep, and your wrist, and release both. And up. Perfect. And do about six more of these. And five, and release. Four, release, three, two, release, and one. Fantastic. We'll switch sides. Another foot this time. I'm not going to go this way. Make it easy for me. Arm, opposite arm down. Perfect. Bring it up. Flex and release. Flex and release. Flex. Excellent. Flex. Release. Five. Four. Three. Release. Two. Release. Last one. Excellent. Fantastic. Shake your arms out. From here, do some heel lifts. Heart lifted. Your back flat. Excellent. Stay with that. Heel lift. I'm just going to swing around here. Excellent. Heel lifts, arms, you're going to bring them up front, hands up, fingertips together, and bring them to your shoulders, perfect. Open up, inhale, exhale your elbows together. So 
Inhale, open. Exhale, together. Excellent. Perfect. Open up. Exhale as you bring your elbows together. Inhale, open. Exhale. Inhale, open. Keep your heart lifted and your back flat. Exhale as your elbows come together. Fantastic. Inhale, open. Stay here. Bring your arms out to the side. Back to your shoulders. Out. Back to your shoulders. Work at your own pace. Back to your shoulders. Three more. Excellent. One more here. And out. Back to your shoulders. Fantastic. Bring your arms down. Out and perfect. Shake them out. Try and keep your feet going here. Your heels going. Excellent. We're going to do some windmills. So again, with your own pace, right? Our big arm circle. Once one comes down, the other goes. More like big swimming movements, I guess, eh? Perfect. Excellent. We're going to change the direction, go backwards. Try and keep these movements smooth. Slow as you can handle. I know sometimes the slow isn't always the easy way. I think you can do it. Excellent. One more on each side here. Perfect. Shake that out. Keep your feet going. Excellent. From here. It. Part the seas. Big breath in as you bring your arms out to the side. Turn a little bit. You know what's going on, anyways. Perfect. One more. Excellent. Fantastic. You shake that out. Take a breath, take a sip of water. Try and keep your feet going. And best you can. Perfect. All right. Go for heels forward. Add your arms. We'll push forward to start. And again, you can bring your heels as forward as far as you'd like. Depends on how you're feeling today. Excellent. And you can also bring your hands up as high as you like. They always stop in line with your body. Excellent. Keep your heels forward. You can change your arms. I'm going to swing them around to the back and push back. And keep your heart lifted. Back flat. Excellent. From here, feet staying the same. You're going to push forward with your arms. All right? So push. You can push with your heels or not. Excellent. Breathe. Make sure you're breathing in through your nose and from your belly. Perfect. 
Bring your arms down, shake them out. I'm going to change your heel to the front to a toe tap to the front. All right, and all those again. We'll start with the low hands facing to the back and push. Get your toe tap to the front. Try and reach as far as that works for you. Excellent. Swing your hands around so they're facing forward and it's going to follow your feet. Toe taps nice and easy. Excellent. Stay with your toe taps. We're going to change our arms. Reach out front and we're going to pull back. You can keep your hands as a fist if you like or reach and pull. I'm doing a little faster today. And again, you can go slower. Reach, pull, reach, pull. Pick the one that suits you the best today. Reach, pull, reach. Excellent. And we're just going to go back to our march. So just pick your feet up just a little bit. Excellent. Add your arms. So just watch your elbows on your chair. You want to try and keep them tight into your body, but not so tight that it's banging against your chair. Excellent. So let's exaggerate a little bit your arms and your knees. Bring them up a little bit higher. And again, look at your own pace. You can get your heart rate up there a little bit. Excellent. Perfect. Bring your feet down. Heel lifts. Excellent. Arms. You can let them shake them out. Perfect. Let's go with some uh, crossovers. So stay with your feet. Perfect. I can see that. My hands are just going to go crossover in front. <laughs> A little bit better here. There we go. Excellent. So it's a gentle twist on your belly. Now your hips are naturally going to twist. Try and keep your torso facing forward if you can. Toe tap to the front. Excellent. Nice. Nice work. And back to our march again. It's nice and easy. All right. Have a sip of water if you like. It's all good. We're going to go to wide march, narrow march. Okay. For four counts of each side, each size. All right. Start in the center. So four, three, two, one. Wide. Three, two, one. And narrow, three, two, one, and wide. You can also and narrow. You can also lift your knees up higher if you choose. And wide, three, two, one, and narrow. And wide, and narrow. One more time for wide and wide. Back to narrow again. Excellent. Alrighty. Back to your heel lifts. Get your heart. Give your hips a little bit of a break here, a little bit of a relaxation. Hearts lifted. Perfect. Fantastic. Arms hang down by your side. Fingertips up. Excellent. 
Keep your feet going. Excellent. Rotate your hands up. Perfect. Fingertips together. Then exhale down, just to the side. Keep your arms out. Flip your palms again, facing up. Touch your fingers. Exhale them back down. Fantastic. Flip your hands again. Up. Touch your fingers. Keep your feet going. And back down to the side again. Take a breath and slowly lower your arms. Shake that out. Nice. Add your arms here for a second. Hearts lifted. Backs flat. Breathe. Nice. I think we should go for some. We're going to do our march. We're going to march to the side. March back to the front. To the side. To the front. That's the idea. Keep your arms going. When you're ready, pick your feet up and you start your march to the side. Doesn't matter how long it takes to get you there. Make your way to the side and then back to the front again. Once you make it to the front, off to the side. Perfect. Keep your heart lifted and your back flat. Back to the front again. Nice. One more time. Off to the side. And back to the front. Perfect. And off to the side one more time. And back to the front. Excellent. Perfect. Nice work. Stay with your march. Get you bring your hands out front. You're going to bring your knees to your hands. So put your hands where your knees can come. And up. You have to bend your arms a little bit to make it so this works for you. Your heart lifted. Back flat. Excellent. Find where that maximum point is that you can lift your knees up to and breathe. Fantastic. Excellent. And back to our march. When you're finding this hip flexors are affecting you, go to hip or feet lifts, or heel lifts rather. Excellent, nice work. Breathe. Have a sip of water if you like. Alrighty, stay with your heel lifts. Aggro or bring them up a little bit higher if you like. Arms out front and reach, grab, and pull. Reach, grab, pull. Reach, grab, pull. Keep your back flat. Reach, grab, pull. Reach, grab, pull. Two more. Reach, grab, pull. Last one. Reach, grab, and pull. Fantastic. Keep your feet going. Hands down by your side. Same thing again. Only going to lift up. All right. So reach, grab, and pull up. Fantastic. Reach, grab, pull up. Reach, grab, pull up. Reach, grab, pull up. Two more. Reach, grab, pull up. Flat back, reach, 
grab, pull up. Fantastic. Get your shoulders set here for a second. Shake your arms if you need to. I'm gonna go up. I'm gonna get you to reach up, grab, and pull down. Reach up, grab, pull down. Reach up, grab, pull down. Excellent. Two more. Grab, pull down, reach up, grab, and pull down. Fantastic. Shake your arms out again. Nice work. I'm going to stay with this rolling march. Have a sip of water if you like. Shoulders. We're going to do some easy shoulder rolls. Hearts lifted. Back flat. Slow your breath down a little bit. And go a little deeper if you need to with your breath. Change direction. So the other way. Excellent. Perfect. Two more. One more. Take that out. Perfect. Keep your knees going, or feet going rather. Heel lifts. Do some shoulder shrugs. We're going to alternate between the sides. Okay, so one side up. Hold it. And down. Switch sides. Up. Hold it. And down. Up. Hold it. And down. Other side. Up. Hold it, and down. Up, hold it, and down. One more, and down, last ones. Up, hold it, and down. Other side, up, hold it, and down. Fantastic. Your shoulders set again. Tuck your elbows into your sides, hands face up. Without looking, fingertips together, fingers to thumbs. Keep your heart lifted, your back flat. And you just cycle between your fingers. Excellent. Breathe. Excellent. Right here, just wiggle your fingers. Nice. Get you extend your arms out. Roll your wrists. Excellent. Change direction. Perfect. Bring your hands up again. Excellent. Fingertips to your shoulders. And then away. Your tips, shoulders, your heart lifted in your back flat. Excellent. Two more. And out. And back. Excellent. Bring your arms, shoulders, everything down to a rest. Shake them out. Nice. Your feet. And do a toe tap to the front. Excellent. Reach a little farther with your toe, not too far, and keep those taps nice and light. Excellent. You can add your arms if you like. Just going to push gently forward. Excellent. Breathe. Keep those movements small. Just a matter of slowing down your heart rate a little bit. Excellent. Heels to the front. Keep your hands the same. Nice. Heart's lifted. You're breathing in through your nose. Perfect. Arms to a stop here. And bring your feet back. Heel lifts. Perfect. Okay, so from here, I'm going to go on to weights. Uh, have a sip of water. You can stand or sit for weights. 
totally up to how you feel today. All right. I think I might sit for the weights. Again, totally up to you. All right. All right, so feet flat on the floor. If you're standing, the only difference between what we do if you stand is that you want to have your knees soft, all right? You don't want to lock your knees if you're standing. So heart lifted, back flat, okay, then drop your arms down by your side. Hands as if they were facing towards you. Of course, they're holding weights, but they wouldn't be. And you don't need to use weights. If you're not using weights, that's fine. I'm just gonna go through the movements, get used to that part. Keep your posture at its best, all right? One side at a time. So go to the side, as high as your shoulder, then back down, all right? Alternate between the sides. And we're gonna do eight on each side. Seven. Excellent. Exhale as your arms come up. Again, try and keep these movements as smooth as you can. Fantastic. All the way down to five. Four. And three. Excellent, and two, breathe, so feed your muscles, and one, fantastic, bring your arms down, and set your arms in your hips, or yeah, hands in your hips, or weights in your hips, take a breath, all right, Once aside, we're going to go high this time. So it's one of your weights. Just set it down beside you. Just out of your way for a minute. We're going to do the extensions. Okay. One hand can be on your lap. doesn't matter where it goes. Hang on to that weight. Watch your head. Straight up. Excellent. And you're going to exhale as you straighten that arm. Excellent. Six. Your back as flat as you can. Five. Exhale as you extend your arm. Four. Keep smiling. Three. And two. And one. Fantastic. Bring that arm down. Keep your shoulders, let them reset. And when you're ready, we're going to switch sides. So if it's going to go work for you today, then jump right in. Eight. Seven. Six. Breathe. Five. Four, three, two, and one. Excellent. And bring that arm down. Set that in your hip. I'm just going to get your other weight now. Bring that back up. Did an excellent job there, by the way. Nice work. We're going to do some uh, uh, front extensions. So I'm just going to turn my chair a little bit here. Turn me around. Arms are going to hang down by your side. Right. Heart's lifted, back's flat, all the usual stuff. And of course, you're breathing through your from your belly. Right. One arm at a time, bring it up. Excellent. 
and down. Other side, exhale it up, inhale it down. Take your time, make these movements as smooth as you possibly can. Excellent. And down to six. Five, <clears throat> excuse me. Four. And three. And two. And one. Excellent work. Nice. And bring your weights into your hips again. Let your shoulders relax, your hands. We're going to do some uh, uh, wrist curls here. So again, you want to be on the edge of your chair, feet flat on the floor. You want to keep your back as flat as you can. You're just going to rest your arms on your legs, your forearms, and your wrists are just over your kneecaps past your kneecaps rather, right? So you want a flat back, keep that as flat as you can, right? Wrists are at a neutral position, just drop them down, drop your weights down, excellent. Be gentle with this, and back up again, excellent. We're gonna do eight of these also. So seven, flat back, breathe from your belly, in and out through your nose, Five, take your time, four, another couple of weeks of this and you'll be open jars for everyone. Three, and two, and one, fantastic. Bring your hands back to that neutral position so your arms are straight and just back. Hands back on your hips. Let your arms, let them be free on your hands too. Take a breath, perfect. We'll do a chest press as the last part of this. And that's with our elbows up, fists together. Right? Keep your elbows bent. And keep your arms apart. Eight. Seven. Six. Keep your heart lifted. Five. Don't forget to breathe. This is a good one to breathe through. Four. Three. Two, and one, fantastic. Bring your arms down nice and easy, perfect. Okay, so that's it for weights. So you just set them off to the side, perfect. Have a sip of water, excellent. So I'm gonna remain seated here. We're gonna do some seated strength exercises. So let's start with a cheek walk on your chair. So you wanna make sure that you can clear your hand between your glute muscle and the chair, right? You walk to the front of the chair and then walk your way to the back. Try and actually lift that hip up as you move, right? Excellent, once you get to the back, walk your way to the front. And then to the back of the chair again. Excellent. And I'm gonna get you to stay here. It's a good spot to stop. I'm gonna do some sit to stands. 
kind of like a squat with a break <laughs> in the middle. All right, so feet flat on the floor, knees are above your ankles, somewhere thereabouts. All right, and when you're ready, just inhale your way up. Ooh, excellent. Big stretch here before we go back down. Excellent. That was a lot of sitting. And you're gonna take back onto your chair, sit all the way back, all right? As you come up, inhale. And as you go back down, exhale. Perfect. Six. Five. Try and keep these movements smooth and not too fast. Makes you work your muscles more. Four. Three. And two. Two. And two. Back down. Inhale as you come up. One. As you go down, you're going to hover over your chair for four, three, two, one. Make sure your chair is there and have a seat back. Excellent. Nice work. I'm going to do a little toe drag here. So just kind of walk your way to the middle to the front of your chair. And again, heart's lifted and your back is flat. Your best posture. Right? Take your toe, extend it out to where you can actually touch the floor. Excellent. Heart lifted, as always. You're going to drag that foot back. A little bit of friction on there. If you're wearing shoes at home and the floor is wood, sometimes you can get it to squeak. That's okay. It's okay with me. I don't know if everybody else in your house would be happy with that or not, but excellent. Drag it back. Four more. And three. Two, and one. Fantastic, gonna switch sides. Other foot, toe down, drag that one back. Seven, six, five, four, three, Two, and one. Fantastic, nice work. I was gonna get you from your seated position, I'm gonna get you just to, as if you're tapping your toes, right? You can hold your chair if you like, or in front, whatever works for you. Try and speed this up a little bit, as if you're going for a run. Excellent, keep going long as you can. Your muscles will tire pretty quick. It's okay. Faster. Excellent. Just come back to that regular speed again. Nice. And just set your feet down. Perfect. All righty. Let's go for um, a leg lift. Sit way back in your chair. All right. Pick a leg, doesn't matter which one you choose. You can lift it up. You're just going to flex and point your foot. Excellent. Keep your heart lifted as best you can. If holding your leg up is too much, just grab underneath. I'd like you to get some ankle movement here. So that's kind of the more important part. And rotate that foot in the ankle joint. 
Excellent. Drawing circles with your toes. Excellent. Change direction either way. Perfect. And set that foot down. And the other leg, same thing. Just going to flex and point that foot. Just lift it up a little bit. That's the ticket. Breathe. Relax your shoulders. Try and put all the concentration down on your feet and your breathing, of course. Rotate that foot. Excellent. You want to change direction. Away. Fantastic. And just set that foot down. Excellent. Give those feet a little shake there. Nice. Well done. That's what we got for time here. Uh, I'm just going to do a little... In our boat here, I'm going to do some paddling. All right. So up to one corner. I'm just going to across your side as you paddle down into the water. Excellent. Four, three, two, one. Excellent. I'm going to switch sides. The other side. Arm up. Nice deep breath in. Exhale as you cross. Excellent. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Fantastic. Shake your shoulders out, shake your arms out. Nice work. Fantastic. So from here, we're going to go on to balance. So I'm going to get you to stand beside your chair. Uh, have a sip of water if you like. Adjust everything. The weights, your weight's going to go on the inside leg. Okay, you got your chair for balance to get you started. So plant that inside leg. Outside leg is going to go heel to ankle. All right, so a rooted tree, they call it. Lift your heart, your back is flat, all right? Again, if you find this easy, go ahead and lift your foot up or put your foot on your calf. Again, lots of options here. Uh, you want that leg open as best you can, like you're trying to and make it a hip opener. If you get a, a kink in your hip, just bring that leg in a little bit. Lift your heart, flat back, test your balance. Excellent. I'm going to try to do this for 10 seconds. Where you're not holding on. That's the goal. And once you get past 10, piece of cake. Nice work. Excellent. Set your foot down. Shake your legs out a little bit. We're going to change our weight to the outside leg this time. Inside leg. Let's do, um, let's do some kicking here. All right. So the outside leg is your weight bearing, inside leg you're just kicking forward and back, all right? Like a pendulum. Keep that leg straight, pull that toe up towards your knee. You'll feel the different muscles kick in. So as your leg goes back, you'll feel all your glute muscles kick in. And as your leg goes forward, you'll feel your thigh muscle kick in. It's all right, take your time, enjoy those feelings. Excellent. You can also take your hand off if you're comfortable with that. Excellent. Perfect. And bring those legs back. Center. Nice. In behind your chair. Turn sideways here so you can see. So come up on your toes. Perfect. Again, test your balance. Hold that there. Lift your heart, your back is flat. Perfect. Now lower down onto your heels. 
Excellent. And then into a squat. Nice and easy. Perfect. Inhale back up. Come back on your toes. And again, hold your chair if you need to, okay? Hold that. Excellent. Slowly lower back down to your heels. And into a squat. Fantastic. Back up. Inhale. On your toes. Hold that. Perfect. And slowly lower back down to your heels. I'm going to stop there. Around to the other side of your chair. And again, we're going to do the same thing. Weight-bearing leg is the inside leg, the leg closest to your chair. All right. And <laughs> don't you hate it when you forgot what you did on the last side? <laughs> I guess we're going to switch here. Or it will come to me. So outside leg is your weight-bearing leg. Inside leg is the straight. Lift your toe up and bring it out front. Fantastic. And then to the back. And you watch your, that your foot will clear the between your leg and the chair. Yep. Once you get that pendulum working, again, test yourself. You can. Keep it nice and smooth. Excellent. Nice. Just a couple more. Last one. Excellent. And bring that leg back to center. Shift. That's the ticket. For the life of me, I still can't remember what I did with my outside leg. So we're just going to wing it here. Inside leg is going to be your weight-bearing leg. <laughs> outside leg, we're just going to pedal here. <laughs> okay. And as long as we're moving it, that's the important part. Excellent. Keep that toe lifted and change direction. Fantastic. Actually, set that foot down. Nice work. And again, shake your legs out. You're going to make your way to the back of your chair. Again, at any point, if you're thirsty, please drink. Have a sip of water. It's the one thing we lose as we get older, that, that uh, notion that you're thirsty. And usually, it's once you're thirsty, then you're already too late. You want to stay hydrated as best you can. Behind your chair again. Five quick pop-ups. So pop up and down. Pop up. Excellent. I want to get to your five. Excellent. Excellent. Perfect. Right there is good. So stay here. I'm going to get you to open your feet apart. So your heels are together, but your toes are quite a ways apart. Start by holding your chair up on your toes and just stand here for a second. Test your balance if you want, if you choose. Hold it up, perfect. Excellent, lower back down, perfect. From here, bring your toes together this time Excellent. Heels apart. Again, behind your chair. You're going to come up on your toes. Be gentle. Okay. So listen to your body. See where it allows you to come up to. And if it does, and you've got your balance, you can test yourself. Excellent. Heart lifted. Back flat. Excellent. Slowly lower back down again. Nice work. Goes out. I'm going to stay behind your chair and get you to extend one of your legs back. Okay. Front knee over the ankle. Excellent. Plant that heel. Breathe. Find that stretch. Three breaths here. Slow your breathing down a little bit. Enjoy that stretch. Excellent. Keep that back heel 
plant it and bend the knee. Excellent. Again, three breaths here. Fantastic. Let's take a step forward, chair. Other leg, same thing. Leg back, plant your heel, and your front knee's over the ankle. Three breaths. Nice and easy. Feel your belly rise as you inhale and bring your belly button to your spine as you exhale for extra points. Excellent. Again, keep that back heel planted and bend the knee in that back leg. Excellent. Again, hold that. Three breaths. Perfect. And take a step. Oh. So you can stay behind your chair. I'm just going to go to the side so you can see better. Give yourself a good stance. Arms out to the side. Your thumbs up. Spread your fingers, reach for the walls. Excellent. Breathe. Excellent. Let's roll your thumbs down. Breathe. Excellent. Roll your thumbs back up. Bring one arm up, the other arm's going to go down. Just going to reach in behind your head. Big stretch here. That hanging arm, bring it around your back. Like you're trying to reach around like a belt. So what does that look like from behind? So just to wrap around. Excellent. So we'll get both shoulders in on this. Be gentle with both shoulders. Breathe. Excellent. Unwrap that lower arm. Bring the upper arm out. Bring your arms out to the side. Fantastic. And the other way. Top arm goes to your collar. Bottom arm just around your back like a belt. Breathe. Three breaths. Excellent. Lower that lower arm out to the side. Straighten that top arm back out again. Wiggle your fingers out here. Fantastic. Lower your arms down into a little squat. The end of our practice today. Nice deep breath in through your nose. Exhale down. Fantastic. Take your time. Inhale up. Exhale down. Last one. Inhale up. And just your arms follow this time. Perfect. Fantastic. Nice work. Excellent work again.